Hey guys, so I'm looking pretty rough right now. Mm -hmm. Okay guys, so basically this was filmed Sunday night and I was just rambling. I looked crusty, there was a booger in my nose, so I don't want to include that footage and just embarrass myself. But basically I did a lot of cleaning and organizing and it was a relaxing night. Um, I sped it up for you guys so you didn't have to endure like a whole 10 minutes because this video is already kind of long enough for what its purpose is, so. Hey guys, so I'm super tired. I've been up since 5 a.m. because I went with my friend Jordan to her dorm to um, like help her unpack her stuff before they like close the campus down like for real, for real. So I'm super tired, but I literally need to get started on my work. Like my exam is technically due today. It got extended until the 6th, so I might not take it today, but I just want to start studying and like get myself back into things because I keep stressing out about it. And if I don't just start it, then I'm just gonna keep stressing myself out about it. You know what I mean? I'm just kind of literally force myself to do it. I'm so tired, but I'm like halfway through a coffee. And yeah, we're just gonna get started working. Hey guys, so good morning. It's currently 11.16. I woke up a little bit late today, which I mean, I'm kind of mad myself for it, but like, oh well, whatever, it doesn't matter. Um, but I got my package. Last week I made an order on Pretty Little Thing because they had 50% off and I never ordered anything from there before. Shout out to Hira for recommending it to me because she had these really cute white sweatpants and I've been so into like at the leisure lately, like wearing like cute sweatpants outfits and like sweatsuits, all that kind of stuff. So I've been really into that. So I thought I would go on there and get some like stuff. Um, I got a lot of like tank top, crop tops kind of things because I kind of want to just branch out of my comfort zone and like when I was redoing my room I kind of realized how many clothes I have and I never wear. I thought I would open my stuff out here because this package did come from, where did this come from? This came from the UK. That's crazy. So yeah, I'm definitely gonna open this out here and like wash my hands and stuff before I take it back inside. And I will try some of the pieces on so like you'll see what they look like on me, but I just wanna do a little try on haul. And also I have this bonnet on. I've literally had this bonnet on for like two days. I want my wardrobe to be more neutral colors too with like a couple like pops of color, but I love pastels. So I did get a couple pastel things in this. So yeah, let's just go ahead and open this thing up. Okay, I know this lighting is probably really bad, but I don't really know how else to do this outside without my dog acting stupid. So we got a new dog, by the way. My mom got it. <clears throat> so yeah, same as Goose. Yeah, we got all this stuff in here. And I rarely ever buy stuff online, so um, I really have no idea what size I am in all this stuff. I kind of just like eyeballed it, so we're just gonna go for it. I'm so excited. I haven't gotten new clothes, especially like clothes that aren't from like the thrift store or like Target, literally in forever. Like I don't, I can't remember the last time I bought clothes. So let's just open everything. It's kind of windy though. I don't know, maybe I shouldn't open this. It's um, a lock necklace because I've been seeing, there's like a Louis Vuitton lock necklace and I really want it, but I'm not about to pay. Like, I don't think it's really Louis Vuitton. It's this weird thing, but I always wear this one and I wanted to get a gold one, so. That's so cute. We stand. Okay, next thing I got, super cute burnt orange color, which I think will look really good when I'm tan. Well, v-neck moment so this next thing is a pink i think it's like a uh, like a t-shirt but like cropped oh my gosh it's so soft the material is so soft but yeah it's just this little um cropped t-shirt and i love stuff like this i'm excited about this shirt this is really out of my comfort zone but i've been seeing shirts like this a lot like all over the internet this is a white frill hem ruched crop top this is very out of my comfort zone i don't know if it's gonna fit me honestly so cute look at it it's like one of these little tops and it's like ruched in the center and then it's like 
uh, frills out at the bottom. I hope it's not too windy. And like the neckline is really pretty. I don't know. I'm excited for it because I don't like two boxy necklines because I kind of have big shoulders. So like it looks kind of weird. That's what this looks like. Oh yeah. So it's just like a straight neck. Oh, I think this is going to be too big. I, I love like the straight neckline. I think it's really flattering and like I love when people wear tank tops and sweats with like a lot of necklaces and like really dress it up and wear like hoops. Also got the same top in this taupe color because I don't know, I kind of like this color. Um, oh, and this next top is probably the most expensive one that I got. Yeah, it was like $18 and that was with the half off sale. Like satin top. I don't know. I just need to try this on before I take the thing off, but this is so cute. I love this and I feel like it'd be so good. You could dress it up, dress it down. Like it's so cute and I love the satin. And then the last things I got were these joggers. I got a pair of sweatpants in baby blue and then I got a pair in white, which you'll probably be seeing on the screen right now. So yeah, that's pretty much it for my haul. Hope you guys enjoyed that. I'm really excited to start dressing better and I really want to go thrifting, but the world's on lockdown, so I can't do that right now, which is unfortunate, but yeah, with my pretty little thing haul, I'll keep you guys updated on the quality of the clothes. They feel pretty good quality, honestly, and I'm really happy that I caught that sale, so shout out to Hira again for telling me about the sale, because without her, I would not have all these new clothes. Okay, guys, so I'm not finished filming the haul. Um, I'm still wearing two of the pieces. I'm pretty satisfied with everything that I got. The only thing that really didn't fit was um, this polka dot top, but like it just barely didn't fit. So I probably could have just got a size larger, which is weird because I got all my shirts in a 12 and that one's a 12, but it does not fit the same way as the other shirts I got have. So maybe it's just the style of shirt, I don't know. But like PLT and stuff like that is like fast fashion and like technically I shouldn't be buying from them. But like, I promise y'all when I'm older and I have my own income and I can afford to spend like more money on clothes i definitely will be more eco-friendly about it but for now i just i just can't afford like i want to go to like i want to shop at reformation so bad like all these good sustainable companies but like i'm broke so what am i supposed to do and that's like the first time i've literally ever bought clothes online that weren't like leggings or like um well, i mean i guess a lot of it was like athleisure stuff but still i'm pretty satisfied so I'm, now i'm gonna start getting ready to do my homework because i need to take my exam okay. I did some studying last night, but today I really want to crack down and just do everything. And also I posted a video last night, which if you're in college and haven't seen it, you should go watch it because it's pretty helpful. So, hey guys, so I know it's loud in the background because I can't over here, but I'm making myself a little workstation corner. I have my whiteboard because I'm going to write some stuff out. I have my iPad up here and then I have my computers and stuff. Everybody's talking, so I'm going to be quiet, but yeah. Just make yourself a little workstation. So I'm going to just do a little montage. studying um but my camera is charged and it's about to die so i'm gonna keep studying it's two o'clock now so i'm gonna keep going take my exam and then i'll talk to you guys later <laughs> 